okay next auto delete set as uh, false okay then my argument should be null okay so all done so what i did so far is so i uh, built the channel uh, so i just uh, declare the queue queue with uh, my queue name uh, durable and here auto delete i kept as false okay so let's start uh, build my message so uh, i will just uh, keep some simple uh, message okay i came from Q. okay something like this we can call it okay just then and we need to convert this to the uh, byte okay so let's convert this okay call it uh, as body okay so encoding so for this we need a namespace encoding dot so utf8 dot get bytes just pass this message over there okay so then finally uh, so my uh, message is ready with the bytes format then finally let push into this channel channel dot basic publish so basic publish this is to send push the data okay and here it asks for the address we don't have any specific we are using in local so the exchange uh, let's keep uh, null so nothing is there and routing key okay routing key we call it as same as my queue name okay base property let's keep null okay and finally my body yes i have body let's pause my body okay so all done okay f the finally yes so so let's write in the console console dot write line Okay, so this message is in just I writing and finally, yeah, all done. So, yeah, console dot right line. Okay, just press enter to exit. So once message run, just I'm keeping just exit. Okay, fall fine. Console done. All right. Okay, so super. So, so all fine now. So let's uh, go and uh, run my application.
so let's check how the things are working okay fine so let's uh, go to the step okay so factory is created so my connection is got created so now uh, my model is uh, builded with and I published okay so yeah so message also ready yes so successfully it's uh, sent to the queue so now uh, the next step is uh, we need to um, create the receiver end so to receive this message so stay tuned this tutorial keep watching thanks for watching the video guys